right soon. Okay, here we go. All right, so it's court time. Yeah, here we go. I'll be fine. This is Apollo's. <laughs> Am I thinking of the fourth one? Is that what it is? And they changed it in this one? It used to be I'll be fine and now it's I'm fine. Or maybe I'm just misremembering. It's been a while. She's fine. Yeah. Dina's attractive. It's true. A bit young. You fool. Big smile. Her hair is really long. Not too many people can say that they can handle having hair that long. Oh shoot, I forgot to change this. Hey, we should change it to, um, hold on, let's save real quick. Uh, yes, yeah, since we're gonna do a court, let's, hold on, can we return the title from here? What we're gonna do real quick, hold on, I'll show you the bottom screen. We're gonna try to pick the other outfits if we can. Extras, ouch, that's loud. Why is that so much louder than everything else? Uh, do I have to do this? Is that the trick to it? No, that's not what I wanted. Ah, sorry. Now we gotta wait. My bad, guys. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, it's it's a little bit real. It's not all about the waifus in this one. God, I wish I could cancel, but I can't. Sorry, everyone. There we go. Now I gotta wait for this all to finish just so I can get nothing because I have all this stuff already. Uh, how do I actually pick the DLC? Uh, extras and DLC, right? This is it, isn't it? Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. So this is where we can change it. All right. So here, this is what it looks like, right? Um, we started with the old one with Phoenix, so we should actually switch to this one since we haven't gotten to see it yet. Uh, and this is... How many does he have? Just these two? Alright. And then Athena has a different one too that we'll pick. Cool. Does Phoenix have two different ones? Oh, okay. Hold on. We have to pick that. That's hilarious. Alright, let's go. Uh, confirm... Cool. And now we can continue. It's funny because he's talking about his new suit and he's in the stupid sweater. <laughs> his usual laid back clothes into his usual laid back clothes. Yes, that was that's awesome. That was so worth it. <laughs> anyway, don't worry, I'll pick his suit in the next case and that way you guys can see it.
So yeah, uh, keep in mind that as of this case, Phoenix has not been reinstated yet. Yeah, Hobo Phoenix. Into Hobo Phoenix? That would have been hilarious. <laughs> In Japanese, it's funnier because you know he's uh, in Japanese. His last name is Naruhodo, which means like I understand or I get it, right? So he becomes Hobo Hodo, which is pretty funny, I think. Or Naru Hobo, that's also funny. Yeah, that's the other one. <laughs> and here's Athena in the schoolgirl outfit, which ironically uh, would actually see her academy in another case that would be later okay here we go so we're heading to the part room Here's Apollo in his outfit. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna meet the newest prosecutor uh, for this game specifically. And this prosecutor is awesome, I can't lie. Uh, I didn't really like, uh, uh, who was the prosecutor last time? Was it not Clavier? Uh, one of the Gavin guys, you know, what, what, was it Clavier? I don't even remember his name, okay? I hate this guy, he's so douchey looking. I really hated him, he was not like a prosecutor that made me feel scared, right? But this prosecutor, it's pretty awesome and then there's something he does that's also awesome that makes it so that he's the dopest like the best counter to uh to the phoenix anything agency he actually counters them which is awesome it's clavier that actually is his name okay clavier sucks i hate that character He's got a band, and I mean, he looks cool. He, he's he's like freaking K Dash. Come on, he's K Dash Yo, thrown into. Black Will's an inmate. Whoa, that's his intro. Jeez. But even a convicted murderer still got a job to do and duties to perform.
Also, this is his team, by the way. This team's dope. Someone said Flynn is <laughs> Simon Blackwell. <laughs> Talking about Flynn from SNT4. I thought the same thing, oh hide, actually. <laughs> Now we get testimony from Bobby Fulbright, the detective we first meet in this case. Don't worry, we'll be seeing Lila's character. You'll get tired of seeing him and be like, oh god, Bobby Fulbright, no, please. Don't ruin our day. By the way, there's an animation here that we're gonna get to see in a minute. Uh, it's of Apollo and um, Apollo and Black Will.
does sound superhuman. Objection! For now, you think that for now is just a threat, but no. again from earlier. Looks cool. Actually, there's a version of this in Layton Phoenix Cross Layton or Layton Cross Phoenix that is really good, also. Okay. bloody statue we saw early on. So here's that transition coming up of Apollo and Blackwell. Glad that I caught it. Now I don't have to sit here the whole time. So this is exactly like last time. For those that haven't seen it before, this is what it looks like. On the bottom screen here, um, I can kind of go left and right and go through everything that he says. Uh, and there's two options. Press, where I can press the witness and get more information. And then there's present, where I can present a piece of evidence if I think it contradicts uh, the current statement that he is saying or that I see on screen. 
So that's why there is to it mostly I'm gonna for the fun and for the sake of the stream and for the sake of us to have fun while playing the game I'll probably press pretty much every statement because there's cool little jokes and things that are hidden in there too So um, yeah, so expect that this whole time I'm pressing and pressing until I find a contradictory statement and then I'm gonna present and that's how we're gonna continue on with the game and that's how you play Phoenix right so that's how it works all right so let's start Hold it. Diane don't want to know if I'm actually gonna stream rejection. Not all the time. Uh, maybe for a certain very special one, I might do that. But not for every single one. That would take wait. Sorry, that would just be annoying to me. So. <laughs> Although I do think that it's cool that you can yell objection if you want to. I think that that's the fact that that's still there in the game is pretty sick. He's <laughs> just like... <laughs> A lot of people think that Investigations 2 is the best game in the series, uh, period. Seems to be the general uh, general opinion of people that have played all the games. I kind of agree, but I, 3 is my personal favorite. Investigations 2 is fun though, good game. They're all good for different reasons. I have the least love for part 2, I guess. Oh shoot, I missed an animation there. We'll get to see it again. There's one where he laughs and he starts banging on the table. Okay. 
This is the last statement, so press. How many times are we going to see Objection! full rights ID in this game, I wonder? Hundreds? Definitely, definitely at least a hundred times we'll see that ID of his. <laughs> So uh, the statement that Apollo brings into question, obviously whenever we see a cue like that we should go for it. This is the statement that Apollo is calling into question and obviously uh, there's something wrong here. It's the, um, where is it, yeah this thing. So um, he thinks that the spear is what got the kill but we know that there's also this statue here with no prints or whatever. Objection! So here's the options that come up. So um, the main thing that's weird here is the no prints. He doesn't have gloves or anything like that, obviously. Here's Apollo Justice's projection theme. He has to feel himself. Aha, I pointed out a contradiction. I can't even speak English, guys. A contradiction. Athena's so happy. So Apollo's theory here is that someone else must have magically done it. <laughs> Maybe a gloved assailant. Hey, he has gloves. Maybe he did it, guys. It's the detective. out the Japanese So here, 
it's pretty obvious um, there's no prints on it because he covered the statue of the car Wow. <laughs> he didn't even do anything. He just slammed his table. And Powell. I wonder if he really is yellow. statue updated and this is what it looks like on the bottom screen now um, so it was wrapped in a large cloth and actually we're gonna go through our evidence really quick just because we haven't done this in a while because there's lots of stuff here and now it's starting to matter so here's all the people we know there's Trucy um, not relevant right now Jinxie the daughter of the accused um, the amazing nine tails um, no one knows his true identity yet. Uh, we do have some theories. Um, Damien. Tenma. He's the accused. Uh, Rex QB. Alderman QB. Who was killed. Um, Apollo's theory is that he is also um, Ninetales. The amazing Ninetales. He was formerly a pro wrestler. Um, here's Athena. This is her first case professionally. She's been a student before this. Um, Mr. Filch. Uh, Bobby Fulbright, who is the detective investigating. We're talking to him right now. Um, Florent LaBelle, who is an aide to Mr. Tenma, or Maya Tenma. Uh, Mr. Wright, cool, he's here. Uh, he's 34 years old in this game. A brilliant former defense attorney who is supposed to be in retirement. Um, the reason why he's in retirement, um, it gets covered in this game, so I'm not going to spoil it, even though it was covered a lot more in the previous game. It'll get talked about soon, I think. If it doesn't, then I'll just talk about it. Uh, yeah, as far as evidence, there's a whole bunch of stuff here. Um, yeah, even I forget what some of this stuff does. Here's the autopsy report. Died around 320. Uh, TV listings, just random not relevant yet might be relevant later jinxy statement a uh, picture of the amazing nine tails oh uh, there's a piece of evidence that just got updated where is it um it's the statue this is what it looks like now um traces of blood from the defendant it was wrapped in a cloth and so this is supposedly in theory what it looked like originally which makes sense based on how the blood stains are on the cloth Uh, yeah, uh, we also have some diagrams of the crime scene might be relevant later in case we need to talk about who was where and things like that. Um, notable is that there's this air duct. Uh, supposedly, um, you cannot easily get to it without like a ladder or something like that. And also the forbidden chamber with those doors that are unopenable. Okay, um, so a little bit of a recap there. There's also this uh, warding charm. Here's that paper with a supposed Tenma Taro literally taking flight. Okay.
Okay. Okay. Nice try. The real killer. God, no. This is what Apollo was afraid of. Objection. Bring this to Mr. Right. What's Mr. Right gonna do? You're the oh god, Athena, please stop. You're hurting my head right now. Indeed. <laughs> They're both so fraudulent. This, I'm not reporting it. Yeah, no kidding. We're not, we're not talking about Athena's childhood yet. It's too early for that. To her and the best. Wait, you have to wait until later. It's too early. We haven't gotten there yet. Shh, shh, blood craze. Don't ask those questions. It's too early. It's too early. You have to wait. It's too early. No spoilers, guys. So Fulbright is also agreeing. Is that scroll again?
Objection! Objection! Okay. What's the point of all of that? Sometimes even I start forgetting what's happening because the characters get so sidetracked that they sidetrack me and I forget what just happened. Alright, but anyway, we're cross-examining. Detective Fulbright. And I'm just gonna press every statement like always.
Objection! Okay, so now we're gonna press this new statement. Hold it! So this statement is the one that's messed up. Let's see if we can figure out what's wrong with it. Uh, percent, it's gotta be something here. Maybe it's the new thing we just got, let's see. What does it say? Details. No, this isn't it. Maybe is there a picture of what it looks like? Ah, okay, so the blood, the feathers are on top of the blood. Objection! Okay, so it, this one is the photo. 
You'll see it in a second. Sorry, I should have switched over so you could see what I was selecting. My bad, guys. what you just said before. <laughs> Just half baked. Jackson! Yeah, sorry, I don't know guys. I don't recommend wearing headphones for this then because I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just some kind of twitch problem or something. 
because we streamed all day and nobody got that sound and then all of a sudden magically you guys all said you heard it right so I don't recommend headphones sorry I don't know what fixes that problem I have no idea what the hell it is seriously if you don't want to hurt your ears don't wear headphones because I don't know what that sound is it's not the stream at least not on my end so it's either XSplit or it's something happening at Twitch. I guess it's XSplit. Who knows? I don't know. Kissing up <laughs> to the judge with Fulbright's shoes. Excuse me. Alright, so we're gonna hear testimony from Filch. So, uh, here is the part where we're going to find out why, uh, <laughs> oh, this part is also, dude, here's where we're going to find out why Black Quill, uh, counters everybody in the right anything agency. This is like 7-3 matchup for everybody. What is that? Look at Apollo's face. You know how much that would hurt if this thing bit you?
Okay. Oh, this is what the bottom looks like, by the way. I caught a part of it. That's the same transition. It always happens during a cross-examination. So here, same thing as always. We're going to press every statement and see what happens. Hold it! Oh, that also means that um, Athena cannot use her power either, by the way. Because yeah, you don't want you don't want to get on that bird's bad side. about that when you yeah seriously nobody nobody in right anything agency is gonna have fun versus blackwell it's never good for them I also wish this game had auto scroll, that would be nice because I wouldn't have to use the stylus as much as I do now. Hold this anything out of the ordinary, he claims. Yeah? Have you looked in the mirror lately? So we have to find a contradiction. Okay, so I think this is the one. Um, if you remember, uh, let's see, I'm going to put the other screen up. This guy mentions that he wanted to watch this wrestling program on TV. Let's see if that coincides with this time. I'm pretty sure this is what it is. Oh, here we go. TV listings. Here's it's 3 o'clock. Uh -huh. Pretty sure. This is it. Objection! Yeah, to be honest, I would do that to Printy Raider, but for me to do that, it's easier for me to like pick the 3DS up or something like that because I'm capturing from it. Um, you know, just for the sake of keeping keeping the setup safe and clean, it's easier for me to just use a stylus for everything. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. 
your Rui Poo lawyer talk. Never mind that this is your statement. seems pretty confident. Okay, so prove that he's lying. Um, I'm gonna assume that one of the diagrams, well, but out here, uh, there's the TV, it's in the caretaker. Yeah, there's no way he was watching the foyer when he was in an office. Take that! So let's present that. Huh. <laughs> 